Hi everyone, this is Sherry from Planning Peep and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing my plan with me and this is for the week of July 9th through July 15th. I'm going to be memory planning this entire week because today is already the 16th and the kit that I have for this week is so gorgeous. I'm really excited about it because um, I did a girls trip with some of my friends to Santa Barbara over the weekend and these full boxes are just so perfect for the occasion that I'm really excited to jump right in. Um, so really quickly I'm going to go over what's included in this kit. We've got some glitter headers here. We have the date covers and date dots. We've got all the full boxes and this one says I want to get away. Let's get lost somewhere beautiful. And then this box down here says adventure awaits. Here we have a lot of functional like text stickers, icons, and checklists. We've got half boxes, appointment labels, quarter boxes, headers, little things, sidebar trackers. And then here we have the ombre square checklist and some little boxes at the bottom. And then the last page we have bottom washi icons and then build do stickers here in the corner. So this is definitely a really full kit, but that will just give me lots of stickers to work with um, in this spread, which is exciting. So let's just jump right in and um, put down the bottom washi here at the bottom. I'm probably not gonna use this thin strip of gray washi. I'm just going to go ahead and use the palm trees. As I mentioned, I'm just putting down the bottom washi first and then I move on to my sidebar. So for this week, the quote box that came in the kit has lighter colors and so I did have to white out the lines um, of the box on my Erin Condren just because it would show through. Um, this kit is on a removable matte paper, which I love because it's removable, but um, it also tends to be a little bit more transparent. Um, but anyways, then I move on to the rest of my sidebar. I put down a glitter header from the kit with a habit tracker and then I use one of those scallop labels to track my happy moments and then at the bottom I used a this week header with a Monday through Sunday tracker for my dinners. After that's all down I move on to my date covers and I just white out everything on my planner because it would peek through and I also use the date dots that came in the kit. So for this week there were some flags that came with the kit and um, again it's really light colored so I did have to white out the flag in the top corner. Then for Monday I started by putting down that today header with a two square checklist for some YouTube things that I had to get done in the morning. Um, I used an upload sticker from Sweet Ava's Paper, which is super cute with the cat. And then I had to pack because we were going on a camping trip that day. My boyfriend and I, it was just the two of us. It was like kind of supposed to be like a test trial camping trip since I'm not really like a camping kind of girl. Um, but anyways, the pack sticker is from Paper and Milk. And then before we got to the campgrounds, we went and got some tacos. So I used a taco sticker from Hazel Sticker. I then put down a glitter header with a full box underneath that. And then um, later on, I do trim down the full box because it just took up a little bit too much space and I had things I wanted to mark. So afterwards, I put down a scallop label with a tent um, camping emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark that the first thing we did when we got to the campground was to set up our tent. I put camping time on the full box as well. And then this is where I'm cutting down the full box, like I mentioned, just because I wanted space to include everything that I wanted to to include. I put down a half box at the bottom and then above that I used a shoe sticker from Sticker Oki to mark that we hiked to the beach which was like maybe a mile and a half one way so it was like pretty good of a little hike slash um, a workout and then at the end of the night we just had dinner and had some beer and just chilled so I put beers and chill the beer sticker I believe is from Art Box Stickers and then the camping emoji again is from the Coffee Monsters Co. Then I move on to Tuesday and Tuesday morning I woke up super early because the light just like flooded into the tent and I could no longer sleep in. So I think I was up by like 7 a.m. which is really early for me during the summer. Um, so I put down a glitter header at the top with a full box. Then I put down a strip of washi and used another sticker from the Coffee Monsters Co. camping sheet to mark that we packed up and then headed home. Um, we did stop by to get some bread from this bakery that we love and so the bread sticker I put down is from Hazel Sticker. When we got home, we did watch the World Cup game that was on. I believe it was like the semifinals or maybe the quarterfinals. I can't quite remember which round we were in at the time. The TV sticker is from Brandy's Shop. And then I took a nice long nap since I didn't really sleep well throughout the night. And I woke up early. So that sleeping mask sticker is from Bloom Paper Studio, which used to be planning in mint. And when we got up, we went out to the mall, um, just wandered around and then got some tacos again. So I used a taco sticker from a happy blue tree to mark that. 
Um, at the end of the night, I don't think I did very much. I just kind of binged on YouTube and just chilled out. So the YouTube binge sticker is from Love Shira. And then I decided I wanted a half box, or I'm sorry, I wanted a full box at the bottom of Wednesday. So I just went ahead and put that down with a glitter header on top. Then moving to the top of Wednesday, we watched the World Cup game that was on that morning, uh, first thing when we got up. So I used a half box with a TV sticker from Brandy's shop to mark that. Um, then I did my nails. So I put down a quarter box from the kit and that nail polish sticker is from Lemon Paper Co. I then had to work on a project that was a gift for a friend. And so I went to the copy printer place to get something printed. That little to-do checkboard is from Bubba Bear Studios. And I think that's super adorable. And I don't think I've ever used one of those before. So I was excited to pull that in. My boyfriend and I then went to watch Solo, which actually was really good. I'm not a huge Star Wars fan. I've seen a good amount of the movies, but um, sci-fi is just really not my genre. Um, but it was actually really good. I enjoyed it. So I used a movie marquee to mark that. And then the popcorn sticker is from the Nay Designs, which is now One Little Sunshine Shop. After the movie, I did some planning when I got home. So I used a quarter box to mark that with a camera sticker. I think the camera is from Sticker Blush. And then I did do a workout. So I pulled in one of the workout tech stickers that came in the kit. I did not have enough space. So I moved the glitter header down a little bit and um, that allowed me to fit the workout sticker. On Thursday morning, instead of using a header, I decided to um, lay down one of the washi strips and then I put that get it done script sticker from the kit right on top of it and I kind of made that its own header which I thought turned out really cute. And then I cut up a checklist to mark some places I had to go to run some errands. Um, that little envelope sticker came in the kit. I then put down a half box and I can't remember where that paint palette sticker is from. I think it was like in a sampler. Um, so I'm not quite sure which shop that is, but I use that to mark that I crafted that day. And it was the um, gift that I was making for my friend. It's called the card game that cannot be named because it's a Harry Potter version of cards against humanity. And it's so funny. You guys, I've played this before and I love it. It is super, super vulgar though. So um, that's just a little warning, but it's absolutely hilarious. So that's what I made my friend and if you guys are interested in the game I will leave that link down below so you can check out the uh, free printable cards and anyways then I put down a glitter header with a full box I put down a half box underneath with a dim sum sticker from happy dia stickers to mark that my friend and I went and got din tai fung and that's where we exchanged our birthday gifts and then my boyfriend and I went to a brewery that night um, the beer girl sticker is from kina prince I decided I didn't like how I wrote stereo which was the name of the brewery so I widened it out and then rewrote it um, and I liked it better. So on Friday, Friday was the day that I was leaving for our girls trip to Santa Barbara. So I put down a glitter header at the top with a full box that says adventure awaits, which I thought was very appropriate. Um, I then used a target run sticker from love Shira because I had to pick up a few things that morning for my trip. And I used a half box to mark driving up to LA to pick up another friend and then um, driving up to Santa Barbara together. So once we got to Santa Barbara, we checked into our Airbnb and then got ready to go out for dinner and drinks that night. The first place we went to was called Santa Barbara Wine Therapy. And to mark that, I used a wine glass from Kylie and Chaos. And then we had dinner at this spot called The Little Kitchen. So I used a noodle sticker to mark that. And the noodles are from A Happy Blue Tree. I ended up not having enough space to mark all the places separately so I put all three of the spots we went to on a checklist and the first spot we went to on the checklist was um, an ice cream place and it was so amazing they had like amazing flavors so I stuck down an ice cream sticker from very cute designs to mark that and then we went to two bars before heading home uh, at the end of the night for the weekend, I started by putting down some strips of washi at the top, and then I layered the weekend banner right over the washi strips, and then I moved to the bottom of Saturday because I knew I wanted the full box there at the bottom. Back to the top of Saturday, we first went on a hike that morning, and that turned out to be a really tough hike for me because it was really, really hot. We got there a little later than we would have wanted, so it was already like 95 degrees out there, and I was just sweating and dying. The hiking mountain 
sticker is from Paper and Milk. Then we went and got brunch. So I used a, I think it's a quarter box with a brunch sticker from Plans with Vanessa. And it's one of my favorites. It's like an Eggs Benedict, which I did have at brunch. So that was super perfect. Um, then we went to the beach and just laid out for a few hours. To mark that, I used a half box with a beach day sticker and that's from Very Cute Designs. I also put down a really happy Maru sticker from Paper and Milk because I was just really happy at the beach with my friends. It was like a perfect 70 degrees and just absolutely beautiful. I then went back up to brunch and decided I wanted to write in the name of the place that we went to rather than just brunch so I can kind of remember a little bit better. And so I switched out the um, quarter box and rewrote it. And then that night we went to quite a few spots um, for dinner and then for drinks and stuff afterwards. So I ended up moving the glitter header up from where the full box was. And then again, I used a checklist to mark the places that we went. Um, the checklist kind of dipped into the full box. So I did have to trim off just like a like maybe a millimeter off of the full box just to make enough space. And I marked the place that we got some drinks, where we got dinner, and then where we got more drinks after dinner. Um, and it was a really fun night. We had a really great time. And um, I used uh, both of the drink stickers that I put down were from Hey Soul sticker. Then for Sunday, I started by using a half box to mark that we watched the World Cup final in the morning. Congrats to France. And um, the balloon stickers are from Kylie and Chaos. And after the game was over, we had to check out and get going. So I used a scallop label with a packing sticker from Laven Forest to mark that. Before we headed out of town, we went to get brunch at this place that had the absolute best Nashville hot chicken. It was so amazing. I like can have this every single day. It was basically hot fried chicken over French toast with syrup and some pickles. And it was absolutely amazing. We ate like every last bite and that was like my favorite spot. So I'm really glad we got to go there before we left. And the very last place we went to before heading out was a wine and beer place. So I used a quarter box with a beer sticker from Dizzy Daisy Dreams to mark that we got our last little drink before heading home. I then put down a washi strip with a heart sticker from Kylie and Chaos to mark that we we made at home and then I decided I didn't have enough space at the very bottom to mark that I did groceries and cook dinner so I cut off a little bit more of the full box to make more room and the crock pot sticker I just put down is from white deer stationery that's it for my spread so I move back to my sidebar and I'm just filling in all of my workouts and my happy moments and my dinners that I like to put in every week and I definitely had lots of happy moments from this week because it was a really fun time so um, that was really nice and that's pretty much it for this week's spread. So I am just going through and showing you these stickers that I have left. I definitely have a ton left over because this was such a full kit. And with my white space planning, I just don't tend to use that many stickers. Um, but I'm hoping to save up my stickers for the next few months or so. And then do another giveaway for leftover stickers. Just because I'm at the point where my storage is so full. And I really don't have space for all the leftovers that I gather. And so I would love to pass it on to those of you that might be able to get some use out of it. But anyways, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I think it came out so perfect for a weekend trip to Santa Barbara. It's so sunny and summery and perfect. So I'm really glad that I got this kit as a birthday gift. Thank you so much, Ashley. And thank you guys so much for watching as usual. Um, I hope you're all doing well and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye.